Hello everyone, this is Prasad Narayan and in this video I will be talking about Simon model. It is a decision making process named after Herbert Simon and Herbert Simon was an American economist, psychologist and political scientist. The model consists of three steps or three phases. The first phase is intelligence. The second is design and the third is choice. So intelligence, design and choice are the three steps in Simon model. Let's take a look. Intelligence, it's got absolutely nothing to do with a person's intelligence or his or her uh, IQ. Here we are talking about problem identification or opportunity that exists. We are talking about, uh, so when a problem gets identified, uh, we are collecting raw data, to find out more about what the problem is. Once you've identified what the problem is, you need to come up with solutions. Come up with multiple solutions. That is what the design phase is, so generation of alternative solutions to the problem at hand. And the last but not the least is the choice phase in which you select the best or the most viable solution that you have come up with in the design phase. Intelligence phase, again as I said, the decision maker identifies the problem or opportunity and the problem could be too many customer complaints, the quality of products uh, are not up to the mark, so that is a problem. Another problem in an organization could be attrition, which is uh, quite common. Attrition could be voluntary, it could be involuntary. When you talk about voluntary attrition, we are talking about uh, resignation of an employee. Um, the employee has been retired. Involuntary could mean the person uh, has lost his job or because of poor performance or there could be a reduction in force. Opportunity, you know, company organizations, you know, have opportunities to, let's say, come up with a new product because it doesn't exist in the market or because um, the, the competitors don't offer the same product or it could also mean when to launch product. So we are looking at market opportunity. So again intelligence phase we are talking about problem or the opportunity and the decision making process is initiated based on what the problem is or based on the opportunity. Next comes the design phase and here we are talking about the design phase is nothing but the process of designing solution for the problem. So we identified what the problem is now we need to come up with a solution. We need to come up with multiple solutions. So alternative solutions are designed and then you are looking into evaluating each of the solution. You are trying to weigh the pros and cons. Yeah, identify the positive and negative aspects of each solution that has been identified. And the last but not the least is the choice phase. Here we are looking into uh, not just comparison but come up with the most suitable solution for the problem at hand or the most viable solution based on uh, the, the, the solution that exists. So these are the three uh, phases, intelligence phase, design phase, choice phase. When you come to think of uh, opportunities, uh, you can you know come up with some other examples as well. Uh, many other examples based on the industry, based on the domain. But Simon model is, this is exactly what Simon model is uh, and it is something that we deal on a, on, on a person, in, in our personal lives and also in our professional life. Thank you for your time. Bye for now.